whilst I was painting the piece, there's a door here, and just the brick wall going straight across was like fine, but it wanted something to break up. Now, so I thought, well, try a door. What kind of door would it be? So this is like, like an old steel door. I mean, there's grime and grotty stuff behind there, maybe. Everybody uses their imagination. But I think that's worked so well, the way that wall ends and you've got this extra dimension of it going round there and this little bit of the sunlight. And this, the, the letter A here, to work out how that perspective would affect the, the direction that the... I had to get a piece of folder, that piece of paper, and draw an A on it and fold it up to see how that works. But then a door, with the, the gap under the door, that, that I thought, oh, you'd have a mouse coming out of the gap to have a little look round. A little mouse coming out of the gap. So I decided that we'd have a mouse in there. And, and this is the only painting. There's, there's only two paintings of this ilk where I've ever had the interaction with two animals. So the, the, um, the mouse is coming out of the door. And then there was a, a famous artist, Terence Cuneo, who is um, one of my heroes, actually. Wonderful painter who used to put a little mouse in his paintings. And almost a little comic mouse in his paintings, a little bit like that. So that reminded me of him. And so that's why I've put the TC there, and it actually says Cuneo's Corner here. Um, and then, of course, this is a green door, and it's Den's door, because I'm thinking Lion's Den. So it's Den's door, and then someone else has put Den's green door, because I'm thinking, well, what lies behind the green door? The reason the door's green is because then I started thinking about the song. There's an old piano, and it's playing hot behind the green door, you know, so the door had to be green. Um, so where, where it says Den's door, somebody's put green. And then here... It says, remember what the Dormouse said. And of course, the Dormouse is from Alice in Wonderland. And then, but the door, I've spelt it as in D W O R, Dormouse. And then somebody's inserted green Dormouse. And of course, remember what the Dormouse said. Well, those of you who know about the band Jefferson Airplane, that will probably relate to you. If not, go Google it. <laughs>